What's up guys? Welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm your boy Zawoki and we're back at it with another Nukes Top 5. But this one is for from a viewer again, Perry Stark. There's another viewer that as well that I do believe I want to remember. Her name was Carol. She has told me there's another video for me to watch as she has given me a link as well. Which I'll watch hers either tonight or tomorrow. But we're going to be watching Nukes Top 5, the one that he requested. That 5 scary ghost videos that will scare you silly. He says this will give me goosebumps. I love when the things give me goosebumps. So with that being said, grab a chair, grab some popcorn, to take a look at this video and how it's going to scare me silly or us silly. Roll the intro. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed, make sure you guys smash that subscribe button down below. Turn on notifications as well by hitting that bell icon down over here. And then... Make sure you guys comment and like and share the video because I definitely love watching your guys' like. Well, obviously, who doesn't want to see their likes go up? But I also love reading your guys' comments. And if you guys th think they're scary, if, they're, if you don't think they're scary, you guys just want to tell me how your day is, that's okay. I want to see your guys' comments, so make sure you guys do so down below. And then also share my videos. And thank you guys very much for the people that have subscribed already. You guys are amazing. You guys are legends. I can't thank you guys enough. You guys are fantastic people and fans and... I call I, I consider you guys family. So with that being said, keep telling your your friends, your family, your mom's friends, and their family. Tell everybody, okay? So with that being said, let's get into the video. Scary or five ghost go story or videos that will scare you silly. Like I said in every single video, usually I do believe in the afterlife when it comes to ghost phenomenon, paranormal activity kind of stuff, but. I do like to debug things as well. So, I'm, I wouldn't say I'm skeptic, but I wouldn't say I'm a complete true believer in the paranormal, but I like to figure out if things are real or not. So, and then also make sure you guys go over to my, my dude, Nuke himself, and subscribe to his channel as well. And then with that being said, let's get the clip. I'm so excited. Top five ghosts caught on camera. Meanwhile, on TikTok. The TikTok ones, for some reason, I love these so much. I don't know why, but I love the TikToks because they're done. They're to the point. It gets over. You don't have to sit there for four or four or five minutes watching the clip and then finally see like two seconds of it. It's like, show me the good stuff and then get it done and over with and let's go on to the next one. So, meanwhile, TikTok, I love them. We went on holiday to Spain. Oh, it's a doll! We I hate dolls! A plaza in a little village, and some guy came. Nope! A woman named Kirsty bought a doll while vacationing in Spain and brought it back. That was your first problem, is you bought a doll from Spain, and then you're worrying to... If you guys happen to find a doll that's for sale, and the people that own it say it's haunted, or no, go ahead, have it for free. Don't take it unless you buy it from Walmart, Target. If you don't buy it at a store, don't touch it. Because it could be haunted. I hate dolls. If you guys know my channel, if you guys have seen my videos before, I hate dolls. And this is right up my alley. So, get it. Back home with her to England. Hi. Immediately, strange things begin to happen around her home. She says that one night at 3.10 in the morning, she heard strange noises from her child's playroom and got up to investigate. It wants your soul. Is that doll going off or is that the TV? She's shaking. It's just chilling. Another night, she notices that the doll seems to be moving on its own. Because if you guys don't know, obviously if you guys have watched Annabelle or any of these ghost hunting shows, like the ones that we watched before, the demon or the ghost is not actually inside the doll. It's around it, it's possessed, it's, I wouldn't say possessed, but it, the doll is haunted obviously, but it's used as a conduit to show the presence of either a demon or a spirit. The spirit's not inside. It uses it to show that it's there. So if you see the doll moving, or it's like for, it's right, right here for five seconds, and then two days later, it's over here. Hello? 
Again, don't buy him. <laughs> Stupid people are buying these dolls. She grabs her phone and films a quick video. Good. Bro, is that sped up? It's moving fast, bro. All of this is just a little too bizarre for Kirsty. She sets up CCTV cameras to monitor the doll at night, and she decides to lock the doll in a cabinet. You should put. But you said, you should really have said your Hail Mary and all that. You probably pissed it off. You pissed it off. Baby doesn't want to be in the closet. Did you lock it? <laughs> Watch it falls out. And I don't see any string. After this, she even tries putting the doll outside for the night. This has been going on. The mail slide. Since like eight o'clock this evening. We've actually put the doll in the car because things have got really strange. Yeah. Open the door. Is that scratching? Yeah, look to the left, look to the right. I want to see if anybody's there. Nope. Why would you put it in your car? There she is. Ah! Oh <laughs> that, that doll is literally like. You rang. <laughs> the family brings the doll back Bro. inside, but continues to monitor it Come with on. CCTV cameras. One night, they catch something truly Oh my gosh. Bizarre. So we just set up the camera ready for tonight, and we Love her caught accent. something. We're not sure what it is. It's just freaky. I don't know. You can say uh, the least. Look at the bottom of the video and you'll see it go past. The video's two seconds long, so yeah. This stuff at the bottom, don't tell me, ooh, I see orbs. I don't care about orbs. I don't believe in the orbs because it could be dust particles. So don't say, ooh, I see orbs. No. I love the village, though. Love, love the Christmas village. It almost looks as if something runs past the camera. Oh, that was a what the? That was, was that a orb. possessed doll haunting Kirsty's home, or is it all? You just need to take it to the Vatican hopes? and get it blessed or thrown away. Kirsty's story still continues. I might have to go check it out. Video updates on her TikTok at KirstyX91. Go check her out, guys. Disappearing act. Twitter user Daniela Garo says that her parents own a security company in Costa Rica. One of their Rica. very freaked out security officers sent them this video. Is it that person? She's like wearing a dress. Yeah, but the thing is, she just. Nah, -uh. hold on. He's walking. Like a brunette with some type of white dress on. Now, if this were a camera video compression error, it would be very abnormal. Because yeah. the woman actually disappears as she gets closer to the camera and in brighter light. Also, as one viewer noted, the woman doesn't seem to have a shadow. But is it a glitch or a ghost caught on camera? You decide. I don't know. I know that there's things that could happen with cameras if they. That's it. I don't know. <laughs> oh, she has no the shadow. Alan, let me know down in the comments what you guys in thought about that one. Video, I featured YouTube ghost hunter. Franco. I love Franco TV. If you guys haven't checked him out, make sure you guys go check his stuff out. I love his channel. Take a look at it. It's awesome. Go and go and watch it. After after this video, watch this video. Then go watch his. TV's Stop. visit to the Weeping Angel Cemetery in Florida. That's a, caught some oh, I go there once. Terrifying footage. What the hell is that? I've seen the old woman. She's creepy. What's that black thing? 
What the hell is that? Oh! I haven't seen that! What the? It literally goes. And you can actually hear a response back. <laughs> I can't! I can't right now! I got goosebumps. I can't. I don't rem I remember this one, but I literally just freaked the hell out right now. <gasps> I'm all goosebumped out. Oh my gosh. Oh, I've seen that clip before, but I didn't think it I've never seen the black figure, and then it went to this figure. I've never seen that. I saw this one, where you see the girl behind the wall, but the black figure... So it all, it all rolled into one and I got chills. So yes, Perry Stark, you have given me goosebumps. I wouldn't say it scared me silly, but I am definitely got goosebumps. <laughs> what is that? No, no, I can't. Ah! And then he goes there and there's nothing there. Somebody would literally have to book it down that way. Shadow. Yeah, I did too. This week, Franco TV made a return visit to the Weeping Angels I'm Cemetery. I'm still goosebumped. -y. And things were just as spooky as before. Stop it! First, <laughs> Frank finds an odd storage cellar under the building where he had previously seen a shadow apparition, and he immediately begins to hear strange noises. I want to check out this one area here. Now, the last time I was here, you could literally see like a shadow. I'm gonna run over here, but today I'm gonna try something a little bit different. Let's go in a creepy little tunnel. Watch my six here. Why not? We're gonna go inside. Oh, uh, be a homeless person in there, bro. Oh crap! I hope there's not like a dungeon. Not a dungeon, but like a, a cavern. Who's on top of it? Say maybe. Walking up there, bro. There were subtly footsteps. Later, he walks along the graveyard pathway, and then this. Just that one woman. I haven't seen that part. Oh! This oh! somebody punched it. But some of the most chilling things in Franco TV's video, he didn't even notice as he was filming. That's a good stuff. All of the following incidents that I'm about to show you were pointed out by Frank's viewers. Yes. At one point in the video, that one Frank begins a strange game of Marco Polo. Why? Marco. Oh, what was that? Probably asking why I'm seeing Marco. It's a little inside joke. Well, it was supposed to be a joke, but it, on one of my videos, I do the same thing. And you could actually hear a response back. Frank I've doesn't notice, that. but some very observant viewers pointed out that he might have actually got an answer. Marco! No! But then, things get even more bizarre. Franco makes a turn around a building and catches something truly chilling. Oh boy. I'm actually gonna try to get towards the back. semi-transparent figure seems to float by behind the hedges but Frank doesn't even notice 
don't know what it is. It cuts out. I don't know about that one. Later in the video, he comes face to face with something. Uh oh. What the? What was that? All right. The mist. An odd mist seems to move right past him. But he doesn't see it. Oh, Some it could be energy. That the strange fog almost looks like a face or a person walking. But oh. Let me know what you think. Yeah. Say it down you below. See the rest of Franco TV's video over on his YouTube channel. Franco TV. Go oh, check him out. I like his stuff. No fun. No fun. Boondocks Food and Fun is a small amusement park in central Colorado. Nuke's top five viewer, Drake, says that when he started working at Boondocks, he had heard rumors about the place being haunted by oh, the ghost of, course of a little is. girl. Workers reported strange knocks and that so much fun. I'm no one else was sick around. of COVID. I want to go out. And some even reported seeing objects move on their own. So one night, Drake and a couple of his fellow co-workers are watching the security camera, and they see this. No. It's just dropping straight down. No. What is it? Way. What is this, Pennywise, but no. purple? Being way. 145 exactly. And watch, it's gonna just stop and stay there. Like, but balloons do that with their falling, helium. But, look. Yeah. It even went back up. Now, it's interesting to note that the balloon doesn't hover around or move on the bridge. I've seen balloons. Like a normal I've balloon seen balloons do this though. Helium. It actually moves straight down and then just stops in place. Almost as if it's being pulled by someone. This but one I'm not so sure. I've seen balloons kind of do this a though. A few seconds later, they see this. What the? I have not seen okay. that kind of stuff. What the? F and then there's motion yeah, over, there. over there. Look over yeah, there. There's all motion over here. Some dark shape that's just too big to be a bug moves across the screen in front of their security camera lens. The CCTV switches into night vision mode, even though the lights are still on. Drake says that these cameras are mounted over 10 feet in the air, so it would be impossible for a person to simply walk in front of the camera. And this is not the way the night vision usually behaves. So is there a ghost haunting boondocks food and fun? Mm, the decide. shadow? I don't know. A but the balloon, stay. I've seen that happen though. YouTuber Antonis Vlahos explores allegedly haunted houses across the Greek countryside. Ooh. In this particular episode, he is visiting a farmhouse that is said to be especially haunted. Oh, of course it is. All of the previous owners passed away under strange and unusual circumstances. Isn't it always? And the last owner, an elderly doctor, went insane in the house before dying of a heart attack. The family attempted to hire workers to renovate the home so that they could sell it. But after a few weeks, the workers absolutely refused to return to the house. No! Saying that they had experienced constant paranormal activity since they began their work. They want As more Antonis money. As enters, he begins to explore the house. When you have headphones on, it makes a world of a difference when it comes to foamage! If I see something, I'm gonna lose it. He finds a creepy old doll that the former residents claim is haunted. No. After exploring the house and setting up dolls. his equipment, he retires to one of the house's bedrooms. His plan is to stay two full nights in the haunted house. Because he has nothing better he to do. He decides to bring the allegedly cursed doll into his room, just to see what will happen. And it doesn't go well. Do uh, you think it would? That's how you sleep, bro? Woo! Wait a minute. I want to know how much of a gap is there behind. That moved a little weird. Watch the head. I wonder if anybody's underneath this bed. I'm pulling it up like... Eh! That looks really weird. <laughs> That's what you do? That's what you do to a haunted doll?
Oh my gosh, what an idiot. I'm sorry, but... But things get even weirder. Why is he so when aggressive? When he returns to his room and resets his camera, something seems to be lurking just outside his door. Oh gosh. Something that he doesn't even notice. <laughs> Bro, that's weird. It's crap. That was the mom. He explores the house and again without noticing captures Is that just light? Bro! That's gotta be like lighting or what the f How do you not see that, bro? Antonis returns to bed, but in the end, he doesn't accomplish his goal of staying in the house two days. Just leaves the, the camera. family that owned the home eventually decided to just have the house demolished. They have not rebuilt on the property. If you would like to suggest a video Don't you've ever. seen, or maybe even a video that you caught yourself, Email it to me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. And hey there, friendo. Please follow me on Twitter at nukestop5. Go do it. Thanks for watching and see you next week. All right, guys. Well, that one definitely gave me the heebie-jeebies. Even this girl's eyes right here. This is kind of, uh, it's kind of creepy. I think I've seen that one. Before. But still, the beginning one and that one behind the corner after the black figure, that definitely got me going. So Perry Stark. Good job, but you can't get me to the point where I am literally crying. I've only cried once when I've seen a, a scary thing, and nobody else has been able to since. So if you guys can find the scariest video that either Nuke or Frost Nightmares or um, Slapped Ham or Bizarre Bub, any of these people that have those, find the scariest stuff for me and send it to me in a link or on Twitter. Facebook or Instagram. I want to see what you guys got. So that being said, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the rest of your guys' night. And we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.